when we, we would trail our cows home, we'd trail five or 600 cows from our kite ranch to our home place. And it was a three day cattle drive and, <clears throat> and we'd spend a night out, so on and so forth. But I hated being the, I hated being the tail, the trail or the tail, you know, eating dust all day long. I hated being the front because my house, my horse would not walk the cattle. So I found myself, I wanted to be on the side, looking up on a hill, looking at, because our, our cows would, they'd be spread out in a, in a <laughs> line for two miles, uh, a good two miles. And I wanted to be on the side. And I thought, you know, that's how I want to lead my company. We know our vision of where we want to go. I want to be able to see both ends very clearly. So I can step in at the back if I need to push my janitors a little bit and, and clean bathrooms better, or my leaders are not no, following the path of where, where I want to go. Um, I want to be on the side. So I always tell people, I lead from the side. We as a company know where we want to go. That's we, we made that very, very clear. Our vision is very, very clear. So now, do I, am I always out there in the front, you know, looking behind me, making sure everybody's there? Absolutely not. I'm on the side making sure the leaders, my four or five, six vice presidents, are carrying out the mission of leading, uh, managing everything, but I also want to be able to see the tail end. And so I'm, I'm, I tell people I'm retired. I don't do anything, but I, that's kind of the story of my life once I got into leadership. Now, again, my mind never stops. I never quit hiring and firing and everything else, but, and I create visions and everything else, but I'm not necessarily, once the vision is set, I'm kind of on the side, making sure, looking for opportunities. Uh, I've got time to do podcasts. I've got time to go look for new opportunities because I've got a team that covers for me and their skills are doing what they're doing. My skill is looking for opportunity, setting the pace, uh, setting the standards, making sure our toilets are clean all the way up to our P&L statements are, are being produced and we're profitable.